Assalam o Alaikum wa Rahmatullahi wa Barakatuh friends welcome back to my channel in this video we will discuss full bridge switching what is the full bridge switching if we see here in the oscilloscope in the DSO this is our center line in one condition the voltage are going upside and in next half cycle the voltage are in negative pattern the same upside the same lower side we will discuss the model of full bridge switching and we will see response of this model on the multimeter and on the oscilloscope so it will become easy to understand full bridge switching basically these are four MOSFETs four transistors four IGBTs they are connected in this pattern the positive voltage which are stored on this capacitor we will see the DC voltage on the capacitor it has 293 volt we can say it is 300 volt 300 volt it is peak from here if we see an oscilloscope if I set probe to 10x because this time I am using 10x probe so it is displaying 300 volt peak so it is switching 300 volt upside and 300 volt lower side it is 300 volt peak and if we check AC voltage on the output terminal it will show us 217 volts these voltage are RMS 300 volt multiply it 0 0.707 so it should be around 212 volts so our multimeter will show the one side peak 217 volt 218 volt because this time these are the square wave voltage we have four transistors here in this drive the positive voltage applied on the top side negative voltage are applied here when the four switches are off which are driven from KA7500 that is 50 Hertz or 60 Hertz switcher that will drive these switches and these switches work in cross this one and this one when this is on that means it is connected it is connected these two will remain off in this cross so now the positive voltage are, re are reaching at this line and the negative voltage are reaching at this line in next half cycle this switch and this switch will open this switch and this MOSFET will turn on first the positive voltage were going here but now immediately when this switch is, switch is off this switch is turned on the negative voltage ride on this output line and this line become positive now when the cycle will change this line will again shift now the positive will go in this line negative will go on this line let's see on the oscilloscope as well and we will see on the multimeter the polarity of the voltage how it will change now if we see the model of this full bridge topology full bridge switch how it is working when all the MOSFETs are off condition these are the output terminal the center pin output terminal this one and this one we can say one is line the second is neutral this time it is open circuit it is open circuit it is open from positive to negative negative to positive everything it have no connection here it have no connection here when for example this MOSFET will turn on it will make connection with this one so positive voltage will reach at this line if we see the second line this switch is off this switch is off there is no connection so we need negative voltage now negative voltage are here in the bottom side so if you connect here and we turn on this switch so this this switch will make connection with negative line so we will take the negative voltage from this this transistor and positive voltage from this transistor in this condition we are taking minus 12 volts 
y minus because this time the negative line is connected here and if I connect oscilloscope here DSO here this negative line and we are taking the negative voltage that is the full voltage which have, which we applied here now if we turn off this switch we are taking zero volt here zero volt here if this switch will turn on we are taking positive voltage now negative 12 volts now if we turn off this switch and this switch in the center line in the output line we are taking 0 volt if we turn on this switch and this switch it is 12 volt and we are taking the positive output if this switch is off this switch is off and this cross is on we will take negative voltage these two will turn on in the cross and we will take the negative peak so positive peak and negative peak will shifted with the operation of these switches off off this one is on and this one is on positive voltage at this cross we are taking positive voltage at this operation we are taking the negative line so this line will swap from positive to negative line and neutral will inverted all the time first we will take positive here then we will take positive here negative here then negative here so it will keep swapping all the time with the change of operation of these MOSFETs in the cross then the most important subject here in this full bridge topology that is the dead time imagine when this switch is off this switch is off we don't have any voltage but if this switch is on and this is off that means the positive voltage will come in the output side when this switch is on this is off now the cycle will shift this will turn off this will turn on so there must be a time gap between the switching off this one and switching on this one if these switches will make crosstalk or these will make overlap when this is turning off the same time it will turn on so it will make a short circuit here why because this time it is not fully turned off and it started to turn on at that time it will make a cross crosstalk it will make a short circuit it will become heat up when we select MOSFETs when we select a drive for full bridge topology we must take care for the dead time this must be turned off completely then it have to turn on so that the positive and negative DC rail should not be short circuited friends I hope so this video is informative if it is informative hit the like button if you have any question please let me know in the comment box now we will make a quick, quick cycle we will turn on this one and this one and we will see now I will turn on now this switch and this switch is on 12 volt positive line this is off this is off this one on and this one on in the cross 
so the negative voltage and the peak is in negative side so this is the sequence of switching friends I hope so this video is informative if it is informative hit the like button if you have any question please let me know in the comment box thanks for watching Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh